Welcome, fellow seekers of enlightenment. Get ready to explore the mystical depths of self-discovery as we uncover the profound wisdom of the stoic art of stillness. In this thought-provoking video, we'll be unpacking the 12 keys that unlock the secrets to finding tranquility in a chaotic world. What does it mean to be truly still? How can we cultivate inner peace amidst the chaos that surrounds us? These are the questions we'll be exploring as we embark on this extraordinary journey together. So fasten your seatbelts and prepare to be captivated by the insights and practical techniques that will transform your life. Through riveting storytelling and expert analysis, we'll unearth the ancient wisdom of the Stoics, renowned for their ability to remain calm amid the storms of life. Discover how their timeless teachings can help us navigate the challenges of the modern world with grace and resilience. But hold on tight, as this won't be a dry lecture on Stoicism. Oh no. Welcome to the Abyss of Wisdom. In the hustle and bustle of modern life, finding stillness can seem like a daunting task. But as we delve into the Stoic philosophy, we discover that the art of stillness is not just about the absence of action. It's a practice that requires discipline, self-control, and a profound understanding of what truly matters. Today, we explore 12 keys to unlocking the power of stillness, drawing insights from Stoic thinkers like Seneca and Marcus Aurelius. Key 1. Walking. Seneca. The Stoic philosopher believed that walking was more than just physical exercise. It was a profound mental and spiritual practice. In the midst of our busy lives, taking the time for a daily walk can serve as a powerful key to unlock the door to stillness. As you step outside, away from the noise and distractions, nature becomes a backdrop for reflection. The rhythm of your footsteps creates a natural cadence allowing your mind to settle and focus on the present moment. Seneca once said, He who is everywhere is nowhere. This echoes the sentiment that in our constant pursuit of being everywhere and doing everything, we lose touch with the essence of being present. Whether it's the solitude of a morning stroll or the camaraderie of an evening walk with loved ones, walking provides an opportunity to disconnect from the chaos and reconnect with our inner selves. The natural surroundings, the rustling of leaves, the chirping of birds, they become a symphony that drowns out the noise of our thoughts, inviting a sense of calmness. Consider incorporating walking into your daily routine. It doesn't have to be a lengthy journey. Even a short stroll can make a significant impact Use this time to let your mind wander, reflect, and find stillness amid the motion of life as you take each step. Remind yourself that this moment, this very step, is enough. Embrace the simplicity of the act and the profound impact it can have on your overall well. In the Stoic philosophy, walking is more than a physical activity. It's a deliberate choice to step away from the noise to find clarity and to unlock the door to stillness. So, put on your shoes, step outside, and let the rhythm of your footsteps guide you towards a more centered and tranquil state of mind. Key 2. Limiting News Consumption In the age of information overload, the stoic approach to stillness involves a deliberate and conscious decision to limit our consumption of news. Cable television news, designed to captivate with sensationalism, often leaves us in a state of constant agitation. The continuous stream of breaking news, often filled with crises and conflicts, can inundate our minds and create unnecessary stress. It's a paradoxical situation where staying informed seems to bring more anxiety than enlightenment. The Stoics, renowned for their emphasis on inner peace, would caution against the addictive nature of news consumption. Instead, they propose that true understanding and wisdom 
come from more thoughtful and deliberate sources. So, what's the Stoic strategy? Philosopher Seneca suggests that the best way to be informed is to read books, which provide a more profound and reflective understanding of the world. Seneca, he who studies books alone, will know how things stand in the Forum and in the Senate better than those who are actually there. By turning to more timeless and in-depth sources, we can escape the constant barrage of sensationalism and focus on developing a deeper understanding of the world around us. The Stoic approach to stillness involves being intentional about what we allow into our minds. Instead of succumbing to the addictive cycle of news consumption, consider redirecting your attention to more meaningful and constructive pursuits. Create designated times for catching up on news and be mindful of the sources you choose. Consider alternative ways to stay informed, such as in depth articles, documentaries, or books that offer a more comprehensive and reflective perspective. In the pursuit of stillness, the Stoic philosophy encourages us to be discerning consumers of information by limiting our exposure to sensationalized news. We can reclaim mental clarity focus on what truly matters, and unlock the serenity that comes from a deliberate and thoughtful approach to understanding the world. Key three, quiet time and alone space. In the fast-paced rhythm of modern life, finding moments of quiet time and creating a space for solitude is a pivotal key to unlocking the stoic art of stillness. This intentional practice is not about isolation, but rather about fostering a deep connection with oneself. Imagine a quiet room, a secluded corner, or even a serene outdoor spot where the noise of the world fades away, allowing your mind to recalibrate and find a sense of tranquility. The Stoics recognize the value of quiet reflection the ability to step back from the external clamor and engage in inner dialogue is crucial for understanding one's thoughts, emotions, and ultimately achieving stillness. Creating quiet time and alone space is not a retreat from life's challenges. Instead, it's a deliberate act of self-care, offering a sanctuary to recharge and gain perspective. Marcus Aurelius. Very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. Marcus Aurelius, a prominent Stoic philosopher, emphasized the importance of the inner world. Quiet time and alone space provide the canvas upon which we can paint the landscape of our thoughts. Designate specific moments in your day for quiet time, seek out a space where you can be alone with your thoughts. Whether it's a few minutes of meditation, a short walk, or simply sitting in stillness, allow yourself the luxury of this mental retreat. As you immerse yourself in this quietude, be present with your thoughts. Acknowledge them without judgment and let the stillness unfold. This practice of carving out moments of solitude contributes to the foundation of a more centered and resilient self. The stoic wisdom encapsulated in the practice of quiet time and alone space reminds us that amidst life's chaos, finding moments of stillness is not just a luxury, it's a necessity. By intentionally creating spaces for solitude, we embark on a journey towards self-discovery inner peace, and the profound art of stillness. Key four, journaling. Journaling, a timeless practice embraced by many throughout history, stands as a powerful key to unlocking the stoic art of stillness. It goes beyond merely recording events. It's a deliberate act of self-reflection, providing a canvas for the mind to explore thoughts and emotions the act of putting pen to paper has a unique way of externalizing internal dialogue, creating a tangible space for 
introspection. The Stoics understood the significance of this practice in fostering self-awareness. Stoic thinkers like Seneca and Marcus Aurelius were known to keep journals, using them as tools for self-examination. By documenting their thoughts, challenges, and triumphs, they were able to gain clarity, confront their own beliefs, and cultivate a resilient inner citadel, Seneca. We should give our minds a rest. We shouldn't keep them continually at the stretch. Seneca's words echo the sentiment that journaling allows the mind to unburden itself, creating space for stillness amidst life's demands. As you engage in this practice, let your thoughts flow without judgment. The page becomes a non-judgmental confidant, allowing you to express, question, and understand your inner world. In the pages of your journal, you hold the keys to your own growth. It becomes a repository for insights, a mirror reflecting your evolving self. Through this intentional act of self-expression, you nurture the stillness within. The Stoic practice of journaling is more than a writing exercise. It's a profound journey into the depths of self-awareness. As you take pen to paper, you embark on a quest for stillness, one that unravels the layers of your thoughts, unveils your true essence, and empowers you to navigate life with a resilient and centered spirit. Key 5. Commonplace Book the stoic practice of maintaining a commonplace book serves as a key to unlocking the art of stillness. A commonplace book is not just a repository of random notes. It's a curated collection of ideas, insights, and reflections that contribute to the development of a robust inner citadel. Imagine a journal where you gather thoughts from various sources, books, conversations, or personal reflections. This practice revered by Stoic philosophers, provides a unique lens through which to view the world. The Stoics spoke of the inner citadel, an untouched space within oneself. A commonplace book becomes the foundation of this citadel, a fortress of wisdom constructed from the bricks of diverse ideas. As you intentionally collect and organize these thoughts, you're not merely transcribing words, you're cultivating a garden of insights that can withstand the storms of external influences. Marcus Aurelius, known for his reflections on inner tranquility, would likely appreciate the idea that a commonplace book is a testament to the richness of one's internal landscape. Start your own commonplace book. It could be a physical journal, a digital document, or even a dedicated section in your existing journal. Capture ideas, quotes, and reflections that resonate with you. As you revisit and add to your commonplace book over time, you'll notice the emergence of patterns and themes, a testament to the growth and evolution of your inner world. In the quiet moments of reflection with your commonplace book, you'll find a source of inspiration, guidance, and solace. It becomes a compass guiding you towards stillness amidst life's complexities. The stoic practice of maintaining a commonplace book is an invitation to actively engage with the wisdom of the world. As you compile your own treasury of thoughts, you forge a path to stillness, a path that winds through the landscapes of your mind, uncovering the serenity that lies within. Key six, meditation. The ancient practice of meditation a cornerstone in the Stoic philosophy serves as a profound key to unlocking the art of stillness. In the modern world, apps like Headspace offer a bridge between timeless wisdom and contemporary technology, aiding us in cultivating a tranquil and focused mind. Imagine a moment of stillness, guided by the soothing voice on your meditation app. As you close your eyes and breathe, you embark on a journey within, a journey towards the serenity that lies beneath the surface of daily distractions. Stoic thinkers, such as Marcus Aurelius, practiced a form of meditation in their pursuit of inner peace. It wasn't about escaping reality, but 
rather about gaining mastery over one's thoughts and emotions. The stillness achieved through meditation is a testament to the power of the mind to create its own sanctuary, unaffected by external circumstances. A modern meditation app exemplifies the fusion of ancient wisdom and contemporary tools. By offering guided meditations, it becomes a companion on the journey to stillness. Incorporate meditation into your daily routine, using tools to guide your practice. Find a quiet space, sit comfortably, and allow yourself to be present in the moment. The consistent practice of meditation can gradually lead you to a state of profound stillness. As you embrace meditation, you embark on an inner exploration, a journey that unveils the tranquility residing within you. It's not an escape from reality, but a return to your core, where stillness becomes a source of strength and resilience. In the moments of quiet reflection facilitated by meditation, you'll discover that stillness is not an absence of activity, but a state of inner harmony. It's a key that unlocks the door to a sanctuary within, an enduring source of peace. The stoic practice of meditation facilitated by modern tools is a bridge between ancient wisdom and modern technology. As you engage in this timeless practice, may you find a haven of stillness within, a place where the mind transcends the noise of the world and tranquility becomes an ever-present companion on your journey through life. Key seven, zooming out for perspective. In the pursuit of stillness, a crucial key lies in the ability to zoom out and gain a broader perspective on the challenges and uncertainties that life presents. This stoic practice encourages us to step back, detach from the immediacy of situations, and view our circumstances from a higher vantage point. Picture yourself standing on a metaphorical mountaintop, observing the landscape of your life. The noise of daily concerns fades, and a sense of calm descends as you gain clarity from this elevated viewpoint. Stoic philosophers such as Seneca advocated for this practice, emphasizing that by distancing ourselves mentally, we can better assess the true significance of our worries. Seneca, he suffers more than necessary, who suffers before it is necessary. Seneca's wisdom suggests that much of our suffering is self-inflicted and can be mitigated by adjusting our perspective. The stoic invitation to zoom out is a call to recognize the transience of circumstances, fostering a mindset that is resilient in the face of challenges. When faced with a situation causing stress or anxiety, consciously take a step back. Imagine viewing the scenario from a higher altitude, acknowledging that in the grand scheme of life, its impact may be less significant than it appears in the moment. By cultivating this practice, you cultivate a mental resilience that allows you to navigate life's ups and downs with a steadier demeanor. As you integrate the practice of zooming out into your daily life, you'll discover that stillness is not just an absence of turmoil, but a perspective gained through distance a perspective that brings tranquility and understanding. The stoic key of zooming out invites us to transcend the immediacy of challenges, to gain a broader perspective on our journey. In the grand tapestry of life, may you find solace in the realization that stillness often resides in the panoramic view, a view that provides clarity, resilience, and an enduring sense of peace. Key 8. Embracing the present. Amidst the pursuit of stillness, the Stoic philosophy offers a profound key. Embracing the ordinary in a world often driven by the quest for the extraordinary. Finding tranquility can be as simple as appreciating the beauty inherent in the everyday moments. Imagine the subtle symphony of daily life. The hum of city streets, the rustle of leaves, or the comforting rhythm of a household. These seemingly mundane elements hold the potential to be sources of profound stillness. Stoic thinkers, including Epictetus, 
emphasized the significance of finding contentment in the ordinary. By embracing the simplicity of life, we free ourselves from the constant pursuit of grandeur and external validations. Epictetus, we have two ears and one mouth, so that we can listen twice as much as we speak. Epictetus's words suggest that within the ordinary lies an opportunity for heightened awareness, a form of active listening to the subtleties of existence. Embracing the ordinary is not about resignation, but about a deliberate shift in perspective, a recognition that within the seemingly mundane, the extraordinary aspects of life often reveal themselves. Take moments in your day to intentionally observe and appreciate the ordinary. Whether it's savoring a cup of tea, listening to the laughter of loved ones, or feeling the warmth of sunlight, these are the threads that weave the fabric of stillness. As you cultivate this practice, you'll find that the ordinary moments become portals to a quieter, more centered space within, an antidote to the restlessness of constant striving. Reflect on the simple joys and moments of calm that unfold within the ordinary tapestry of your life. In doing so, you may discover that stillness is not a distant destination, but a harmonious presence within the everyday. The stoic key of embracing the ordinary invites us to find tranquility, not in the grandiose, but in the simplicity of daily life. As you savor the ordinary moments, may you unlock a deeper sense of stillness, a stillness that resides in the gentle rhythm of the commonplace, offering peace and contentment on your journey. Key 9. Detoxifying from distractions. In the modern age, where distractions abound, detoxifying from the constant barrage of information and stimuli emerges as a crucial key to unlock the stoic art of stillness. The stoic philosophy encourages a deliberate retreat from the noise of technology, social media, and incessant connectivity. Imagine stepping into a world free from the incessant buzzing of notifications, a world where the sounds of nature take precedence. This intentional detoxification is not an escape, but a recalibration of attention and focus. Stoic thinkers, aware of the detrimental effects of perpetual distraction, would advocate for creating mental space. Seneca's words, he who does not prevent a vice when he can, encourages it resonate in the context of our contemporary struggle with digital distractions. Detoxifying from distractions is an acknowledgement that, in the quest for stillness, it's essential to reclaim control over our attention and choose moments of intentional focus. Designate specific periods in your day for a digital detox. Turn off notifications, set boundaries on social media usage, and allow yourself the freedom to be present in the moment without the constant pull of technology. As you detoxify from distractions, you create mental space, a space where stillness can flourish and where the relentless hum of the digital world gives way to the tranquility of focused presence. Reflect on the moments when you intentionally disconnect Notice the mental clarity that arises in the subtle currents of stillness that become more pronounced when the distractions fade away. The stoic key of detoxifying from distractions beckons us to reclaim control over our attention in a world inundated with stimuli. In these intentional moments of disconnection, may you rediscover the serenity that arises when the mind is free from the relentless chatter of the digital realm. Key 10. Cultivating Gratitude. A profound key to unlocking the stoic art of stillness lies in the practice of cultivating gratitude. In a world often focused on what's lacking, stoic philosophy invites us to shift our perspective and find contentment in the abundance that surrounds us. Picture a moment of quiet reflection where you consciously acknowledge and appreciate the simple blessings in your life. This practice is not about denying challenges,
but about fostering a mindset of appreciation. Stoic thinkers recognize that gratitude is a powerful antidote to discontent. Epictetus, in his teachings, highlighted the importance of focusing on what we can control, and expressing gratitude for these elements is within our control. Epictetus. We cannot choose our external circumstances, but we can always choose how we respond to them. Cultivating gratitude is an active choice, a choice to direct our attention towards the positive aspects of our lives, no matter how small. Incorporate a daily gratitude practice into your routine. Take a moment each day to reflect on three things you're grateful for. This intentional focus on the positive aspects of life can significantly contribute to a sense of stillness and contentment. As you cultivate gratitude, you'll find that stillness is not only about finding peace in the absence of turmoil, but also about discovering a deep sense of fulfillment in the abundance that surrounds you. Reflect on the transformative power of gratitude in your life. Notice how a shift in perspective towards acknowledging and appreciating the positives can be a gateway to inner stillness. The stoic key of cultivating gratitude beckons us to look beyond what's lacking and appreciate the abundance in our lives. In the practice of gratitude, may you find a reservoir of stillness, a stillness that springs from a heart filled with appreciation. Key 11, the art of saying no. A vital key in the stoic pursuit of stillness is mastering the art of saying no. In a world that often glorifies busyness, the stoic philosophy encourages a deliberate and mindful approach to commitments and obligations. Envision a moment where you confidently say no to additional commitments creating a space for stillness amid the constant ticking of the clock. This practice is not about avoidance, but about discernment. Stoic thinkers, such as Seneca, recognize the importance of guarding our time and energy. Saying no is a manifestation of the Stoic principle that our most valuable resource is not money or possessions, but time. Seneca, it's not that we have a short time to live, but that we waste much of it. The art of saying no is an acknowledgement that, in the pursuit of stillness, it's crucial to protect our time from being consumed by activities that do not align with our priorities. Develop the ability to discern between essential and non-essential commitments. Practice saying no to tasks or events that do not contribute to your well-being or align with your long-term goals. As you master the art of saying no, you create boundaries that safeguard the precious moments of stillness in your life. Saying no becomes a deliberate act of self, care, and a pathway to maintaining a centered and tranquil existence. Reflect on the instances when saying no allowed you to preserve your mental and emotional well-being. Notice the sense of empowerment and calmness that arises when you prioritize stillness over the constant pull of external demands. The stoic key of mastering the art of saying no invites us to be intentional about our commitments. In the gentle yet powerful act of saying no, may you find the freedom to cultivate stillness, a stillness that flourishes in the spaces you create by wisely choosing how you invest your time and energy. Key 12, hobbies and creativity. A profound key to unlocking the stoic art of stillness is found in the wisdom of embracing impermanence. In a world that often clings to the illusion of permanence, stoic philosophy invites us to recognize the transitory nature of all things and find serenity in the acceptance of change. Envision a moment where you acknowledge the ephemerality of existence, much like the gentle rustling of leaves in the wind. Embracing impermanence is not about resignation, but about embracing the flow of life. Stoic thinkers, such as Marcus Aurelius, understood the inevitability of change. 
The recognition that everything in life is subject to the passage of time was a cornerstone of their philosophy. Embracing impermanence is an acknowledgement that stillness is not a static state, but a dynamic dance with the ever-changing rhythm of existence. Cultivate mindfulness around the impermanence of life. Whether it's observing the changing seasons or reflecting on personal experiences, allow yourself to appreciate the fleeting nature of moments without clinging to them. As you embrace impermanence, you foster a mindset that is resilient in the face of life's inevitable fluctuations. The ability to let go becomes a gateway to inner stillness. Reflect on instances where embracing impermanence allowed you to navigate life's uncertainties with grace. Notice the liberation that arises when you release attachments and welcome the natural ebb and flow of existence. The stoic key of embracing impermanence invites us to dance with the ever-changing nature of life and the fluidity of impermanence. May you discover a profound stillness, a stillness that flourishes when anchored in the wisdom that nothing lasts forever, and that within this impermanence lies the beauty of each fleeting moment. In a world filled with chaos, practicing the stoic art of stillness becomes a key to unlocking our potential for professional success, personal happiness, and contentment. As we navigate the challenges of modern life, may these 12 keys serve as a guide to finding tranquility and unlocking the true essence of stillness.